Pat Wright. I'm representing LegalizeFerrets.org. We are pointing the Commission to the uh, policy statement of introduction of non-native species. Proposals to introduce exotic species shall be submitted to the Commission for approval. The Department will review... This issue's been before this Commission since I've been on it in the 10 years, at least four other times. And uh, when we do take the trouble and time to agendize it, uh, we always have uh, enough testimony to, to, uh, on the other side of the issue to convince us that uh, keep the status quo. If it's going to be illegal, it needs to be illegal, and, and those folks are breaking the law and need to be punished for it. Okay. I'll give him five minutes. Five minutes? Five minutes, all righty, thank you. We've been waiting at the mailbox patiently. We spent $13,000 in a year of research at Sacramento State University for an unbiased preliminary EIR report. Uh, our CEQA consultant also did the CEQA environmental checklist. We have yet to hear back. So I want to make sure, am I making this request right? Do you understand the request that we're asking you to do? You know what, I'm going to respond. I'm going to tell you again. We are charged with the protection and preservation of our natural resources and, and species. And that's what we're going to do. And we don't feel that, I, even though you have a right to your opinion, that you're right on this issue. We right, feel yeah, like th we that's are. That's not my question right now. Is, is, am I making the, correct, the request in the correct manner? I'm putting a formal request. You haven't, you haven't, uh, you haven't negotiated or investigated ferrets at all. I'm asking you to do so. Am I doing it correctly? We have in the past, and then there was a good enough investigation to satisfy our position. Okay, the last request was April 6, 2000. The commissioners requested a preliminary EIR that they would not move forward unless the proponents funded the EIR. We have done so at great expense and at great time. Uh, my mother used to tell me, you can't fight City Hall. And I hope what she meant is don't expect it to be an easy job, because it hasn't been. The last time Ferrets was on the Fish and Game Commission agenda, uh, two items back to back, the February 3rd and 4th agenda, 2000, uh, followed by the... So my question is, why won't you take this seriously? The fair discussion has been held a minimum of 12 times by this commission over the years. Okay, and where, where is as that? As well as in, in, in executive session, so... Can you kindly point out where? You got a copy of the request, you can learn to read it, and you'll see that we have discussed ferrets a minimum of 12 times. Now it's a dozen times. It used to be four and five. He hasn't seen the issue, you know, in open session, you know, since he's been on the commission. I don't understand. They don't agree that ferrets should be legalized. They're legal in 48 states. Why is California so different? That, that, that is not a subject they're prepared to engage you on. Good morning. First off, has the preliminary import impact been reviewed by anybody on the commission? And second of all, if it has been reviewed, when can we expect the commission to review to get the formal EIR? Anybody? You got three minutes. Continue to testimony. Um, those are pretty much the questions I needed to ask, answer within my three minutes. Is is there anybody available just to answer the question? It has not been reviewed yet. Okay. Is there a time limit usually allotted for reviewing of a document such as this? No, there's no, there's no timing. It's just as soon as we can get staff that have the expertise to review it and look at it, and then what we'll do is review it and probably provide the um, submitter comments on the document. My name is Jeremy Trim. I live here in Sacramento. Uh, I represent Legalized Ferrets. We, numerous months ago, turned in an, a preliminary environmental impact report at your request. Uh, since then, we have had received no response. So we'd just like to know what's going on. Thank you. Can I get an answer? It was a pretty simple question. How do we 
go forward? No answer. You're going to sit there and look at me. All right. Christine Newman, Eric Mills, Paul Week. Thank you for giving me a few minutes. My name is Michelle Coach. I'm representing Ferrets Anonymous. Pat Wright has submitted the environmental impact report. Um, Ferrets Anonymous has offered to pay for the staff time and to have ferret owners pay license fees to help cover potential increased cost to fish and game. And um, that being said, I'm, I'm wondering if there's anything else that we can do to help facilitate moving this to going to notice. Thank you, Michelle. We addressed no. this issue uh, at, after an extensive public comment. So what's going on? Thank you. Can I get an answer? So I'm afraid for now uh, we are unable to move forward with and we don't intend to move forward with the rulemaking package on this issue.